It's a rainbow. There's a rainbow in here. In my, yeah. There's like a rainbow and some scaffolding. I think that's Maui or, yeah. That's right. Anyway, uh, and I have many more trips. I'm going How to many, Russia. When are you going? Oh, yeah, we are, we're going together. Uh, yeah, that'll be nice. Uh, I, listen, I speaking of foreign countries, yeah. uh, our next guest is from Bulgaria. She's been, in the, she's been in the country for 12 years. All you'd never know it. She has zero accent. Uh, her name is Marianne Parker. She is the owner of Manor of Manners. Uh, you can go to the website, Manor of M-A-N-O-R, like, like, you you know, know, like the Bruce Wayne man. Look at how pretty she is. I know. Uh, Mannerofmanners.com. Uh, she's also uh, an author of two best-selling books, uh, Posh Overnight, The Ten Pillars of Social Etiquette, uh, and uh, the, shar the, the Sharpest, I don't even know what it's Soft called. Skill. Soft Skill. There we go. What is that? I well, give you, ask her. Marianne right Parker. Marianne, how are you? <laughs> Great to have you. Good morning. I'm very glad to be here. All right, here's my nice. first question. Here's my first question. You like that? Yeah, I do like it. Yeah. Uh, my first question is, what is the difference between etiquette and manners? Is there any difference? Well, there is a, a quite a big difference because good manners are something what you uh, probably is a, a very basic knowledge. Okay. But when we include etiquette, it becomes much, much more sophisticated. So okay. I call uh, my book The Sharpest Soft Skill because I believe that uh, etiquette can open a lot of doors and looks like a diamond. It's just so glamorous, so beautiful, but you can actually, it's so sharp. That actually you can cut window like glass. See, so you, do you yeah. think, how's your etiquette? It's I don't know. I don't even I don't know. Even I, know have my, I don't know. So here, so first of all, how did you get it? How did this become a passion of yours? First of all, go go to the beginning. Educated. Well, yeah. I, I educate us on it. Yeah. <laughs> I was in the corporate world for many, many, many years, over 15 years, and I worked in all over the world in different corporations. And nice, I've noticed yeah. that there is a lack of et ethical uh, communication, leadership. So there is a lot of, um, uh, it was a big niche, I, I thought, at the, yeah, at the right. time. And, and I decided maybe I can start uh, something um, basic and to try, try to introduce uh, etiquette to people. So you just wanted to try to make things better in the corporate world to start off with. Yes, huh? this is this is what happened because a lot of people work in corporations with a, a lot of tux, uh, talk in a very toxic environment. Right. So hmm. we want to change that if we can. So I decided to uh, build my company, and here we are. I'm talking about business etiquette and social etiquette. So this is not not necessarily just you know belching at a restaurant or talking too loud on a cell phone. This is maybe stealing. And is it true in Bulgaria <laughs> that after a heavy <laughs> meal, it's it? <laughs> Boy, yeah, to let you know, it's no, I'm just telling you, do in Bulgaria. But I'm saying that uh, etiquette-wise, in business. The, the do's and don'ts, the things you should and should, you know, stealing secrets, or I don't. This, this is very true, but at the same yeah. time, when you raise your standards, when you become on a different level in business, you want to be more sophisticated because you're starting to communicate with high profile clients. Right. Uh, corporation, so you need to know your table manners as well. You need so you to don't have some eat sophistication. Your, eat your salad with your main course fork. Um, you know, that's a, no, that's like okay. A, wait a second. Huh? So, okay, so let's break this down real quick. By the way, her her name is Marianne Parker. Uh, you can go to her website. In fact, Jared, if you could show that mannerofmanners.com. Both of her books, uh, Posh Overnight uh, and The Sharpest Soft Skill, is uh, both New York Times bestseller. Uh, so etiquette and ethics are really joined at the hip. Uh, they could they be, not? yes, yeah. yes. Interesting. Etiquette, Definitely. ethics, and uh, then manners. And manners. Okay, yeah. so let's so so the manners let's is over the, here. Like let's the move to the manners thing because, uh, you know, the manners thing is we all think we have good manners. I think everyone just like everyone thinks their kids cute. Yeah, and a lot of times your kid's not cute. Right. Everyone thinks they had their manners are. Okay. I agree with Don't you. Don't you think? Like I everyone will, thinks their manners are fine. Percent. Yes. Right. Just you know, as 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 I'm you know, yeah. as I'm watching folks. Mm -hmm. it, you know, it almost makes, it, 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 when you're in a social situation, most people know, even though I make a living in a very public way, yes. between music, yeah, yeah. between this, how am I, I avoid social settings because right. it gives me anxiety. Because your manners are mm -hmm. terrible. No, so that's you don't, not huh? right. That's bad. That's <laughs> I just have anxiety. And then if I, if I think, it's like I have to go to an event, we have to go to, you can talk to me to go to an event today. But maybe that, uh, that, that. I'm going to uh, use what I'm learning right now to this but event. But that might push bad manners, the fact that you're anxious or you're tense and you just go shut up or go, you, know, you really shouldn't say that or whatever you shouldn't do that or you shouldn't pick your whatever i don't know manners uh. yes you have to really uh, definitely uh, mind your manners because when you start uh, going to a networking event people pay attention oh. and they usually pay oh. attention to the negative part oh, right. he double dipped the yes, chip and the oh. <laughs> he put a chip you know, in the when guacamole you use twice. the word networking event to me oh it makes me want to crawl up in a ball and go in the corner and never look up i think i just saw pierre 
Yeah. Yes. I, 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 yeah. Um, Who's Pierre? He's an auctioneer. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. So, so anyway. <laughs> get me through. So today I have to go to a luncheon for a very close friend of mine. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's the chief of police in San Diego. Okay. Yeah. She's very visible, obviously. We're obviously pretty visible in San Diego. And, and so, and this, I have a little anxiety. I'm actually going to be on Russ's hip the whole time because. At the table. At the table. Uh, so get me through this. T- tell me the don'ts. Uh, make oh. sure I don't drop the ball here, because I want to make sure I've got good, perfect manners in front of the mayor. Well, the mayor's a good friend of mine. He doesn't care. Well, right. you're going for a business occasion, so you have to treat her as a business partner. But at the same time, you can give her a little tip that she's the lady, because a lot of women uh, we become very independent and very confident, so we kind of push away the gentleman side. We just had a person on yesterday talking about that. Yes, that's, that's very detrimental for the for Uh-oh. the yeah. for the men because I'm a lady I'm a businesswoman so too. is it bad manners for me because you are you're obviously intelligent you're articulate you're, you're you're a businesswoman can I open your door still absolutely I appreciate and if it. I don't it's bad manners right that's true nailed it so See, um, Rob, don't get scared I'm not gonna hit you. So, so good. <laughs> it's very much up to the businesswoman as well but when you sit at the table you always treat her as a lady and a business partner just uh, show her box how about a toast to the ladies yeah. Hashtag me too or whatever. No, see, that's probably. Oh. <laughs> well, if you're drinking, I, w- I want to tell you something. You don't clink glasses. A lot of people think that uh, that's. You don't clink? No, you don't. And that's okay. A pain wait, in okay, the wait, ass. wait, wait. We're going to break <laughs> yeah, this Yeah, let stuff me tell down. you this. Start from the beginning no when I'm clink. sitting down. I am okay. so about no clinking because sometimes I can't reach the far clink. And then I thought, I don't dislike you. I just couldn't reach far enough to clink no, you. And then suddenly your hand's on some lady's leg well, while you're reaching yeah, you're over. I'm which so is bad sorry. manners. Yeah. Right. So when God. when uh, the wait the wait staff comes to you, yeah. you don't order for her. She should choose her course and ah, uh, she'll have the. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> so it has to be. Um, we uh, still has to be 21st century. So um, wow. uh, you just that's uh, a keep balance. Her. So what you're talking yes. about is a delicate balance Absolutely. here yes. of yes. not pissing her off and because there, mm-hmm. because she because she's yes. independent. Right. Yeah. At the same time, there's good manners. Oh, it's, right. Yes. Are there is there a checklist? Uh, like, okay, hang uh, on a second. We're, when we come back, she's gonna give uh, give because we need a checklist for today. Well, uh, here's a checklist of stuff that used to be used to work. Does <laughs> it anymore? Work? All right, stand by. And Her name is Marianne Parker. Uh, manner of manners. I think she's. I think she's Ooh. gonna be a regular. Like the ur- uh, <laughs> like the I, Urban Dictionary. Every year, there's new words that come into. Is there are, are there new etiquette? Yeah, I think she's gonna be a regular. That's very true. But you still cannot use your phone on the table. All right, stand by. <laughs> See, Ross, you are screwed. Oh, elbows. Oh, elbows. Elbows. Yeah. elbows. Oh, okay. No sunglasses. See, what happens when you... See, what I want to know is when Russ gets up... You know, when I... The first thing I do when I sit down, Just I got wrong. the wallet, the keys, the sunglasses, the mm-hmm. lap, everything. It's He's like got a, a stack little, going. Like a nice little Personal pyramid. storage unit pyramid. under his ashtray. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right. We're learning about etiquette and manners Slowly. Today. Mm-hmm. Is Fantastic. This wrong? Her name is Marianne Parker. Manner of manners.com. Oh. Big, mm. big That's bad. <laughs> oh. Okay, that's... Uh,